Hi everyone, welcome to Trendy Trading. This is Austin, better known as Dip and Rip. I just wanted to create this video to give you a quick introduction to the Discord platform. That way you can maximize your experience at Trendy Trading. I'll start here from the top. Um, on the left side, you'll have your navigation for all the different channels. I'm currently viewing this role as a pro member, so some of you free trial people won't be able to see all these rooms. But hopefully you enjoy your week and we'll be seeing you in the future. So let's just start from the top here with YouTube. Um, basically anytime John posts anything to his YouTube, it'll be reposted here. If you haven't checked out his YouTube, definitely check it out. There's tons and tons of educational material that will just help you learn the methodology and become a better trader. It's really a great free resource. Underneath that, you'll have his Twitter, and it's the same thing as a YouTube. Anytime you post something on Twitter, it'll just repost here. And if you do have Twitter, it'd be awesome if you could just like, retweet, and you know, give us some support. Underneath that, we have a channel for memberships and indicators. Now you can totally sign up on trendytrading.co, but there are some deals here, especially if you want to sign up for a annual or quarterly package. I believe the quarterly package saves you about 20% and the annual saves you 25. So there's a lot of money to be saved here. Also, there's links to um, the PMZ scanner for TOS. Underneath that, um, you'll find two things. One, if you wanna purchase the TTM Squeeze Pro from Simpler, there's a link to that. As you know, John's been teaching over at Simpler and some of you are from Simpler. So if you do want the TTM Pro Squeeze, just check it out. Um, go through this link that would be awesome but more importantly above it if you are a member we do offer an affiliate program and you too can make money by referring your family friends just posting on the internet if people use your code and you can sign up here we operate through getrewardful.com and I suggest you check it out It'd be totally awesome great so let's move on welcome if you're new here start here Give a quick read to this and then go to the FAQ. If you have any other questions, there's a channel for that. Underneath that, we have TD Brokerage Alerts. Also a little hack, you can collapse and expand categories here. So underneath that, uh, TD Brokerage Alerts, we have Trendy Alerts. And it's here where you'll find our real, real-time alerts straight from our broker. No typing out alerts, no hiding behind a curtain. It's all real time. So let me just give you a quick way of breaking down these alerts so there's no confusion. The only people that post in this channel are Melissa and John. You can tell by the Melissa trade alert and the trendy alert. That's John. Um, let's take one of Melissa's alerts from 1111. She executed this at 1010 a.m. She bought buy to open, BTO, buy to open. Apple calls, 146 calls for $1.15. At 10.13, she trimmed some of that position for 23%, sell to close at $1.42. Now let's scroll down here and see where she actually closed the position so you get an idea of what that looks like. Okay, here we go. So, end of the day, 157 almost two o'clock she ended up closing the position and we know this by the red um, sell to close limit 365 so she absolutely crushed that trade um, right above it just for posterity you'll see that we alert winners and losers she took the cop trade buy to open at a dollar sixty at 1048 and she closed that for a loss of 40 percent at 12.02. So a little loss, but I have a feeling that the Apple trade made up for it. Um, also, really important, besides trading straight directional options, John likes to trade equity. This is important just to, you know, take a look at what vehicle he's using here. So he likes to trade equity. He also likes to trade spreads. And let me show you what that looks like. Where are we here? So here's a great example. We have this trendy alert, butterfly net debit buy to open, sell to open, buy to open. It's really important that once you get this alert, you really break it down, um, especially with these spreads so you don't get confused. Um, yeah, those are the alerts, super easy to read. Um, another thing we've been getting questions on are notifications. So in order to avoid confusion, let's go to user settings. 
we can go to notifications here. I like to enable my desktop notifications, so that is checked. And I also like to leave my push notification in the active timeout to one minute. So that means if I am not on my computer um, for a period of more than one minute, I had to break that down, sorry, then it will push notification to my phone. Um, I actually, when I know that I'm not gonna be next to the computer, I'll just quit my desktop Discord. That way, all alerts will get pushed directly to my phone. And another way that you can make sure that you're getting notifications from this trendy alert channel, or any channel for that matter, is if you just right click, notification settings, all messages. Um, of course, this is to everyone's taste. For alerts, I definitely use all messages. For something like chill chat, I might just do only at mentions. It's, it's whatever you prefer, but at least for the trendy alerts, all messages. Great, so positions, this is just a place that you can keep tabs on John's positions, what he has open, um, if, you've, if you've lost track, you know, what he has open um, in terms of positions, spreads, it's all pretty self-explanatory uh, and just really helpful and it just adds an extra layer of transparency. After brokerage alerts, we'll go down to signals and you will see auto future alerts. These are all alerts that John programs himself. Um, if you don't have the scripts, these can be helpful because they reflect what the scripts alert. Um, we have auto future alerts, we have trendy auto signals, and these signals are used specifically for tickers that John programs in. So he has a focus on Disney or AMD or NVIDIA. He will input a trigger and it will trigger there. Um, some people like to have these on, some people don't. It's really up to you. Same thing goes for SPX. Buy, 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 sell. We all know that Friday was a buy, don't we? Um, yeah, signals. Some people like them, some people don't. If you don't have the um, indicators, you could experiment with this. So there's that channel. Underneath here, we have the chat. So member chat, this is where people hang out during trading hours. Uh, it's everything to do with trading keeping it trendy, we want you to be respectful of other people. We really wanna focus on the methodology that we teach here. So anything from the outside, we sort of consider noise. Um, you can bring in some of those things, but really we just want to be talking trendy and trading trendy. And I think in the end, you'll be happy about it. So under member chat, chill chat is, you know, it, it is what it is, it's chill, it's silly tweets, it's what we're making, that looks delicious, it's what we're making for dinner, it's what we're drinking, it's what we're doing on the weekend. It's really a place for us to um, relate to each other outside of our trading lives and it's just really nice. Share whatever you want and be supportive of each other. Under here, questions and help, you will find help and questions. Ask away and we will help you as much as we can. Um, myself, John, anyone else that pops in the channel will be more than excited to help you on your journey. Great, so under chat we have futures and futures you will find futures charts, futures chat, and voice or stream whenever John is broadcasting, specifically for futures. John's always posting, he's always interacting. Okay, underneath there you will find trade plans and setups. So trendy updates every day before John goes live, he likes to post his thoughts on the day and I definitely suggest you check it out. If there's any major economic events, he will repost it here just so you have an idea. There's updated charts and this is all good to look at, especially if you're on the go and can't tune into his morning broadcast. So check that out. Broad market. Check this out every week. This is the bigger picture, broad market analysis video, um, your neutral zone, your neutral trading strategies, everything you need to start the week off, you should be looking at this on Sundays. It's you know everything you need to prepare yourself for the upcoming trading week. Underneath that, daily focus. If there's a chart in particular that John is focused on, on the day, 11-7, um, we had BABA. Something you should look out for, it's helpful. They're just focused trades. Underneath that, we have trade plans. This can be longer term. So you'll see that today John posted Amazon, XLF, Apple. Take a look at this stuff. They're great charts, longer time frames. 
you know, once we feel comfortable, dare I say, we can start getting into some swing trades. Uh, important to check out this channel as well. Those of you still trading crypto, crypto chat, crypto basics, crypto security, and hope crypto is going well. Underneath that, you will find education. Here you will find just tons of videos that are private for members so they can learn and expand on their knowledge. It's all trending methodology. It's super important to, you know, always, always, always be a student. Underneath that, we have the community journal. Now this, I feel like is underused, but should be used by everyone. This is where you come and break down your trades and learn from your mistakes, learn from your successes, just learn. And I think that by posting it here, you can get feedback from other members, you can get feedback from John, you'll just grow as a trader. So definitely check out that community journal, really helpful. Underneath here, you will find the live stream. So this is what John hops on every day around 9 a.m. Eastern, and he stays on pretty much the whole day. The way you get into the stream is basically when John is live, you will see live by Trendy. Come over here, you click watch stream, bang. That is John's screen. He is away from the computer right now, but if he was on and speaking, you would be hearing him. What I like to do personally is I will pop it out and this takes me, I'll go full screen here. So I can switch between my desktops, just like this. Um, for you, those of you that have multiple monitors, you know, drag this to another monitor. You're live, baby. You are set up. It is game time, as they say. That is a overview of Discord. If you have any questions, reach out to me. If you don't hear from me, reach out to John. Ask in the you know, questions and help room. We're here for you. Good luck. Explore. If you have any questions, once again, questions and help is open for business. Look forward to trading with you soon. Let's have a great week, guys.